Good day everyone, my name is Mahilan and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I am in a place called Lake Bennett in Northern Territory, Australia. This lake is a man-made lake and it is one of the best tourist places in Northern Territory where you can come, stay in an accommodation, enjoy this beautiful lake, go for fishing, kayaking and do a lot more indoor and outdoor activities. We have just arrived here today and I will be here for next couple of days and in this video you are going to watch what we are going to do in and around this lake for next couple of days. If you are new to this channel please consider subscribing to our channel and hit the bell icon and without further delay let's get this video rolling. This is the house where we are going to stay for next couple of days. Let's go for a quick tour around this house and I will show you how it is. You would have seen Peter in some of my videos. That is Pete and his wife playing puzzle. On this side you can see the open kitchen of this house. And over there at the corner there is a sofa set and a TV. Alright, let's go outside and see. In the outside, you can see two barbecues and this is a big open veranda. In this end of this veranda, there is a dining table. A very beautiful place with a nice view of Lake Bennett. This is the back side of the house guys. When we come to this side, this is the way to the lake. We can take our kayak or canoe through this and we can go into the lake. There are some kayaks, canoes and noodles present here. When you rent this accommodation, you can also get these kind of things here. Hello Pete, where are we going? We're going out fishing mate. We're going we are going fishing for lake. fishing. At Lake Bennett. In a canoe. In a canoe. In a canoe. Yeah. Can can Kayak. Is an Indian tribal name. Okay. <laughs> we are going in a kayak. Correct. Yes. So, and Mags's kayak has got his name on it. So you are sending me first. Yes. I am going to use this green color kayak today. In this kayak, I already got my name printed. You can see here, it Don't says Mahi. I think it's a brand name of something. Alright guys, let's go kayaking. We are also taking our fishing rods with us. There are very less fishes in this lake, but anyway, let's try our luck today. Here comes Ellie. Here you go. You ready? Yep, I'm ready. Watch you, buddy. Okay. Hi, Pete. Hey, Max. How are you? Did you enjoy your uh, little escape then? Yeah, I'm enjoying my little escape. Yeah, good, good. We'll go fishing. A quick history about this lake Bennett guys. This lake is located 80 km south of Darwin, Northern Territory, Australia within the Coomali Shire. It is a man-made lake and built in 1980. The total area of this lake is 4.45 km squared and it is a freshwater lake. There are a few freshwater crocodiles in this lake but there is no history so far saying the freshwater crocodiles in this lake ever attacked anyone.
We started fishing now. Let's see if we can catch anything today. In this lake there are a few crocodile traps in place to catch the crocodiles here. I am going towards one of them and let's go and see that one now. This crocodile trap is open now. There are some chicken pieces inside to attract and get the crocodile trapped inside. Let's keep going guys. It is very pleasant and beautiful evening today. The view of sunset is going to be amazing from this lake. In this area we can see a lot of dead trees without leaves. Actually this part of lake is a land area and as the water level during the wet season this year is more, there is more water in this lake and all these trees are standing in water. Look at this spectacular sunset in Topen guys, so beautiful to see the sunset through these dead trees without leaves from the middle of this lake. Alright guys, that is the end of kayaking today. Now we are going back to our accommodation, there is a possibility of catching shrimps from this freshwater lake. We are going to go to the accommodation and fix a few shrimp pots to catch them from this lake. Now we have started fixing the shrimp pods. Richard is fixing the shrimp pods. If you are following our channel before, you would have seen Richard in a video called Gold Deduction in Australia. He's a good prospector and he taught us how to do the gold deduction. If you haven't watched that video, I will leave the link in the description section below. You can watch from there. Alright, we have finished fixing these shrimp pods. Let's go to the yeti and drop them. Hopefully, we will have some shrimps tomorrow morning.
Come on, Bonnie. This is the Yeti, guys. Too many bugs flying around here in this night time. Any bucks? Look at here, guys. There is a snake swimming towards this yeti. Maybe a venomous snake. Mm. Is that a venomous snake? Don't know, mate. Mm. It could be. I'm always going for yes. The frog. Two or three. Going, huh? All right, we have dropped our pots here. Let's go back to our accommodation, have a good sleep, and come back in the morning. Good morning guys, it is time to go to the Yeti first and check our pots whether we have any shrimps or not. You can have a good view of this Yeti in this morning time. Look at this beautiful place and the sunrise guys. This place is full of nature and the chirping sounds from the birds around this place making this place aesthetic. Alright, let's check our pots now. Hopefully, something. <clears throat> Oops, there is nothing from the first one. Let's check our second one. It is too weedy in this place. Yes, that's what I thought. There is nothing from our second pot too. No luck today. It may have been you know, better out in the rock out there. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Well, you would have thought. Now we are going back to our place, finish our breakfast and then after that we will probably go to the other side of this lake in a kayak. There was a bowerbird chirping and making noises this morning and what we found is that bowerbird has a nest here. I will show you guys the nest of that bowerbird. This is the beautiful nest of the bowerbird. Green and white. Usually bowerbirds pick a color and decorate its nest using that color. Here this bowerbird has used white and green colors. It has used stones, snail shells and glass pieces to decorate its nest. This nest is so beautiful guys, isn't it? 
All right, we have finished our breakfast. Now let's go to the other side of the lake in our kayak and see what we can see there. All right. In this side of the lake, we can find a lot of lilies. Most of them are in purple color and there are some in white color too. You can see another beautiful house near this lake over there. There is a boat in that yeti too. I think the house owner will probably use that one in this lake. Now we are going towards an island which is in the middle of this lake Bennett. You can see that one right straight in the direction where we are going. This is the island guys, it is called as Pelican Island, I don't know how it got the name but this island is a shady little place to take some rest while you are kayaking. So this one is also man made one. Let's keep going guys, let's go to the other part where we went yesterday in the evening. There are some lilies in this part of the lake too. Some of them are in purple and some of them are in white. Peter brought his fishing rod today as well and he is still trying to catch something. I don't think he will catch anything today. It is getting warmer now, time to go back to our accommodation.
All right, guys, that is a wrap for this video. We came here yesterday and enjoyed staying in this place and kayaking in this beautiful lake. I hope you guys would have enjoyed this video as well. If you are still not subscribed to our channel, please consider subscribing to our channel and hit the bell icon and I will see you all in another beautiful video. Till then, thanks for watching and cheers.